there's nothing quite like a tense meeting to ruin your day and maybe even give you nightmares that night. In this video, I'm going to share with you three tips that actually come directly out of my martial arts training that can help you lower the tension in any meeting that you're in, whether it's one person or multiple people. So I'm Karen Polensic. I am the author and founder of Spiral Impact, The Power to Get It Done with Grace. And I've worked with leaders and teams for over three decades, helping them learn how to master conflict so they can be in power together for the best collaborations. Okay, so tip number one. Notice when you experience tension, we tend to meet tension with tension. So how do you feel tension? It's like this. So once the tension goes up in the room, watch what you do with your body. And oftentimes it's we raise our center of gravity up, shoulders up, and hold our breath. So make a practice of bringing your shoulders down and breathing. And just that much will have an impact on the people around you. And so that actually comes into a bigger practice in what I call centering, which I'm not going to go into here. So tip number two, think about your physical position. I encourage my clients not to sit across from each other when they are having a conversation where there's big differences. So you want to be around a table where you're, you're not pitted directly face to face with people. Even just shifting your position a little bit will dissipate some of the tension that you're feeling. And the third thing, Oftentimes when there's tension, we are in a battle of wills around an issue and, a, and something to solve. I suggest that you back up, pause, and think about what is the intention of what you're talking about. What is the bigger picture that you're trying to accomplish here? And refocus there because a lot of times when things get tense, we can go down rabbit holes that take us nowhere other than having separation and division. That's it for this video. I'd appreciate it if you will like it, subscribe, wherever you're seeing this. And if you're interested, I do master classes. Go to Karen's master class and learn more about this idea of spiral impact and how to get things done with grace. Uh, see you next time. Bye-bye.